the people you choose to have around you make all the difference. Self-belief and hard work will always earn you success. In the game of cricket, a hero is a person who respects the game and does not corrupt the game. I always dreamt of holding the bat and winning games for India. That was my inspiration to take up cricket. I keep telling myself improve, improve from the previous match, previous shot. You can do it. The bat is not a toy, it's a weapon. It gives me everything in life, which helps me to do everything on the field. I like to be myself, and I don't pretend. For instance, I don't dress up for occasions, I am what I am. I get really motivated when I put on the India jersey. It is a responsibility, so I want to perform in the best way I can. There's nothing more impressive than a great attitude, which you can wear on your sleeve. But you have to remember the difference between being rude and being confident. Irrespective of whether you have talent or not, one has to work hard. Just being talented doesn't mean anything, you can end up wasting it before you realize. A fit body gives you confidence. And there's nothing more impressive than a great attitude, which you can wear on your sleeve. But you'll have to remember the difference between being rude and being confident. Whatever you want to do, do with full passion and work really hard towards it. Don't look anywhere else. There will be a few distractions, but if you can be true to yourself, you'll be successful for sure. I don't think there is anything wrong in earning money from the sport you love. If you work hard and get benefits from it, there is no harm. The day you feel that you are not working hard and are only looking at the benefits, that's where the problem is. On the field, aggression can sometimes be a positive emotion. It boosts performance and can lift your game. But over the years, I have learned that restrained aggression is a better animal. That way, you will conserve your energy and won't spend yourself quickly. I do believe in God. But you won't find me visiting temples every now and then. I believe in self-realization. Peace of mind matters a lot to me. What's the point in doing something just for the sake of it? I'd rather do something I like doing as long as I'm being true to myself. I'm not comparing myself with anyone, but I am very confident about my captaincy, as I have already led India and in the IPL also. I have confidence I can bring out each player's ability fully and also give them a lot of confidence. I would like to stick to what I know best and what I have confidence in. A lot of people tell me a lot of things about my conduct, my game, my future. But I try to stay away from their words of wisdom. I don't let it distract me. On the field, you will be facing the ball alone. If you fail, you will be the only one to blame. So, you should be the one deciding for yourself.